nations, whether they're treaties or other types of agreements, are certainly a key part to what the provincial government works to do to try to build a better future, not just for First Nations, but for all British Columbians. For Glamen, this treaty will bring direct economic benefits, as well as the all-important certainty that economic development is not going to come at the expense of your culture and your traditions. For Glamen, Canada, and British Columbia, this agreement is a new relationship. It's not all about the dignitaries here today. Today is about the Slyaman people. We've uh, we made a lot of good friends along the way, and we also lost some really good friends along the way. Just looking, just looking at the change, the change here. I see a lot of our people here, which is great, and uh, you know, um, our surroundings have changed so changed so much during this process. Uh, Fifteen years. I am so deeply honored and moved to be invited into your territory and to sit here with you today as you celebrate this important moment. In a few moments, the chief negotiators for the parties will be making a few small marks on this very important document. And while it's just initials, it'll effectively end one very long stage of your journey and begin another one. Well, the uh, Slaman final agreement will help achieve comprehensive benefits that promote health, economic prosperity, and quality of life of its members. The agreement will also enable you to build on the work your community has done to preserve and revive your cherished culture, traditions, and language. Thank you for the sign and thank you to all of you people that are here today supporting Slyam and lifting Slyam and up. It's a, just an incredible and remarkable day. And I'm just so proud and I'm so happy to be here with Slyam and people. And it's going to be incredible from this day forward. I raise my hands again to all of you.